Hi guys and welcome to another video by myself, Bates and 87 This is a quick little update video because even though Team of the Year hype is uh, going on, a few of you guys may notice, notice these players entering into packs, but I'm going to do a rundown of the best players to enter packs in the past couple of days, and it's a recap of like free updates, and a lot of them have come in. Some nice looking ones as well. So if any of you guys do want MSP, PSN codes, or cheap game codes, getting stocked up ready for Team of the Year, um, attackers coming out later today, and also the all being packed to the weekend, go and check out G2A.com, their link is down below. If you're trying to hit over 5,000 likes, that'd be awesome, and subscribe if you're not subscribed already so the first player is Osvaldo the reason I put him in here guys is he's got very very good stats for one number two the strong link to Carlos Tevez makes him a player worth getting if you guys still do what Carlos Tevez very good player and I think I may even do a squad builder with Tevez and Osvaldo in the next couple of days for the team of the year tournament the next player we have guys is our man Marcos Lopez you will think that that card looks the same but in, in fact it's actually moved to Lille now so he's got a Monaco card and he's got a Lille card. Four-star skiller in the uh, league and with a uh, with, with obviously a silver. The next one we have is Gabriel. Put him in there for the left wing. Five uh, four-star skiller from Brazil has moved to the Saudi league. So a nice little Saudi league player for you guys out there if you do what with the Saudi league. Next one we have is Mota. Low-rated goal player uh, has now moved to the Super League in Turkey. Actually, I think he might have been already in the Super League already, uh, but that card's out there now. The next one after that, guys, is Amal Fitano. You guys may remember me talking about this in the potential transfer video. He's actually got his card now at Lille as well in the right midfield position. A four-star weak foot, three-star skill move, 6'9 pace silver. Yep, can't imagine you guys wanting him, but he is there. Anyway, we have Donk, Ryan Donk. A lot of you guys may remember this card from back in FIFA 14, FIFA 13, a blue team, the season card. He's actually moved now to the uh, Turkish league with Galatasaray. Who else is at Galatasaray in that camp position? Yes, you're correct. Schneider, I think. I hope it's Schneider. I'm thinking about this and I could be wrong, but I think that's actually a perfect link to Schneider now if you guys are into your perfect links. And he's actually got very good stats for a defensive midfielder. Next one we have, guys, is Lissandro Lopez. A lot of you guys may remember him from playing at Lyon and uh, tearing shit up. He has now got a card in the Premier League division, which is, Argent is that Div uh, Argentine? Argentina League uh, and it's moved from the Brazil League to that one. Next one we have is Graban and he covered that in a potential transfer as well. He's now got a BPL striker card uh, for Bournemouth. Nice little card there but 6-9 rated so I can't imagine you guys going for that one. We have Will Keane now transferred to Manchester United as well. He was recalled on loan as we could cover as well. He's now entered the Manchester United team so a nice little player there. We have a Forby as well. He's now signed from Wolves to Bournemouth and that card is now in the game. Four, three star skills, three star week for 83 pace and 32 physical. Not bad for a little silver. Anyway, we have Brandon Barker as well, a Manchester City um, player. He's now at Manchester City. If you guys are into your bonds players, this guy has 87 pace and looks pretty tidy as well. So a nice little card uh, for you guys if you enjoy your bronze boosts let me know in uh, let me know in the chat the next one we have guys is John Joe Shelby signing for Newcastle and um, this card is now confirmed in the game as well even though a transfer only happened a few days ago and there's another one who is actually at Newcastle which you'll see in a second now this one was mentioned a while ago in my videos where you guys should have invested in the Bundesliga Kirchhoff at Bayern Munich because now this card is staying at Sunderland. He's actually signed for Sunderland and that Bayern Munich card will never be seen uh, again. So you guys, if you're trying to pick him up, his uh, price may rise and we will never know. Next one we have is Shea Ojo. I don't even know how to say that guy's name. Four-star weak foot, three-star skill moves at Liverpool. Left midfielder at bronze as well. If you're into your bronze beast. Next one we have is Sissoko returning from, I think, the Portuguese league at Porto. Um, now plays for Aston Villa nice little card for you and then we have Lurie also returning from um from loan uh, Liverpool terminated his loan now he's uh, come back to Liverpool so if you guys are looking for a silver centre back in the Premier League who is at Liverpool because he has got one at Aston Villa anyway he is now in the game we then have Stephen Corker as well another Liverpool centre back on loan for the rest of the season this card's actually been out for two or three days now and uh, looks pretty good as well so now he is in the Liverpool team and uh, the few final players guys we've got Wallace which I was talking about he's actually gone on loan to someone else so this card is in the game for a couple of days and until he does actually get that transfer um, to a Brazilian league club, I think, anyway. So, you guys, if you're looking for making an investment, he is the way to invest. Next one we have is Saiba as well, and he's also the last one, and he has joined Newcastle as well. So, that is a rundown of all the players in 
uh, in the game now, guys. There is a, a lot more, but there are a lot like low rated gold, uh, low rated silvers, and low rated bronzes. So I thought I wouldn't add them in. But these have been the best of the bunch, and hopefully the Jan for, <laughs> January transfer window does hold up that a little bit more, and we got some players to add in here because currently it's just bits and bats, nothing that much. And uh, yeah, some nice cards. Kirchhoff at um, Kirchhoff at Sunderland's a good one for your silver teams. Wallace is also good for your silver teams as well. A Brazilian at Chelsea getting a perfect link to William as well, being on that side. Um, so some nice little cards there. So guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, rate and subscribe if you are not subscribed already. And we'll be back another day with another video for you guys to enjoy.